Dude, do you have your keys? Oh, wait a minute. Is this my car? Yeah, no. No. Oops, it's not mine. <laughs> All right, so you remember our video just a couple weeks ago, we played here at Ridgewood. Well, today's the day, Thursday, first day of the Northern Trust. We're gonna be here all over it, covering it from this side of the ropes, having a little fun from our uh, own experience, just being fans of all this. So this will be fun, let's jump on our bus and do it. Hey, do you think you can give me a lesson before you get on, real quick? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> All right, Mike, so what are you excited to see today? Well, we're gonna go check out the gallery that's following Tiger. I saw on TV, it's a little big, which is usual, right? So we're gonna head over to 17th Green. That's Frank's infamous hybrid shot from the Ridgewood vlog. Yeah, man. Yeah. So we're gonna go park ourselves there and check out on uh, the gallery over with Tiger. And then I just wanna walk the course today. Yeah. Nope, not today. <laughs> Tell you what, it's not hard to find Tiger, right? No, nope, not at all. <laughs> Just follow the crowds. Tiger, it's like you're a ghost. The Tommy Fleetwood walking right with them, and everyone's just yelling Tiger's name. <laughs> All right, so when we teed off on 18 a couple weeks ago, we were right here, and it was playing long. These guys. The 20 yards back over there. Gotta have a lot of respect for that. Come back. Come back. Oh yeah. So like, literally two seconds ago, Tiger found his ball off the tee right here. Green is up there. Look at all the trees that blocked him out. This guy kept it low. Beautiful draw. Made it back to the green. Crowd went crazy. Uh, this year's Ryder Cup team, JT, Kepka, and DJ. A lot of firepower in that group. Mm -hmm. There you go, DJ. I don't think Mike's forgetting about this tree. The bird tree? Yeah, apparently there's like a deadly bird that attacks everyone that goes underneath it, but I don't know, man, I got lucky that day. I think they cleared him out this week. He was loud that day, but he didn't come down and get me. So, let's see if he's there. So I'd say what I'm easily most impressed by right now is the ease with which these guys make their way around the course. Everything is just planned out, plotted, shot by shot. You know, when we're out here just kind of like hacking, doing the best we can and just like feel like you're pushing a boulder up a hill, but these guys just smooth all the way through it. Very methodical, smart way of playing. Dude, can we get lunch? I'm starving. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Thank you. 
I am gonna say eight. What do you think? Let's see. I'm gonna say six. <laughs> yes! What? <laughs> awesome. All right, so can you name the courses? Ridgewood, played it. Yep. Plainfield Country Club, played it. Beth Page Black, played, played it. it. Yep. Um, Liberty National, played it. Yep. Where else was What's this? that up to? You got four? Oh, Glen, where was last year in Long Island? Glen Oaks, never played it. Okay. And what's the sixth? You need one more. Hmm. Drawing a blank. Yeah. I don't know, comment below. Comment it. <laughs> <laughs> It's so thick, man. It's so thick. It's playoff rough. It is playoff rough. It's a lot thicker than when we played it. All right, guys, we made it over to the dreaded five and dime, which is on the other side of the course. So it's been a little bit of a hike, but we're going to take you to where we were and see how these guys are playing it. All right, so we're just a little short of where you and I were, right? We were a little further up. Mm -hmm. These guys are playing it all a little smarter than we did. They're laying, up. they're laying up right here to get a better look at that green. It's a lot longer coming at it this way rather than what we tried to do coming at it from an angle. So smart play, even though it's an incredibly, incredibly short part four for them. They're laying up here with like probably, I don't know, a low iron or a wedge, and then just taking a gap wedge in, put it in tight, mm -hmm. and getting out of here with the par. But That's yesterday, so Phil, I guess looking for a little bit of redemption because you saw us hit that shot from up there. The Phil was here shot. So Phil in the Pro-Am, I didn't see it, but a bunch of the guys are telling us he almost slam dunked it for a hole in one. Almost had a hole in one here. So, pretty cool. I'm excited to see what he does with it today. How cool is this? World number one and world number two walking together right there. Dustin Johnson, Justin Thomas. Tons of firepower there. So cool. Tell you guys what, I still have nightmares about that ugly bunker shot right there. Ugly, ugly six there. Thirsty Mike. Getting I'm thirsty. thirsty man. I'm getting real thirsty out here. Look at this guy. He's been here all week. He's done. I'm getting tired, man. It's been a long week. Right there's the uh, par three I birdied when I thought I was closest to the pin. Try to remember the good holes, not all the double and triple bogeys I posted out here. All right, this has been my spot all week. It's been my hub. Come check it out. It's the marketplace. It's located right in the middle of all the action here at Ridgewood. So you're all out here, beautiful, sunny weather. I'm go inside and play some video games. <laughs> Fortnite booth. Uh-oh, uh-oh, look who we're running into. You remember this guy. Hey guys, how you doing? There he is. Yeah, nice to see you guys. Everything good? Yeah, you doing a lot of good. fittings or yeah. what? Oh, killing. So how are you enjoying the tournament? Great, great weather. Yeah, Ridgewood's a beautiful country club. So I've, I've played here a couple times, so it's it's great. I'm out here with my kids, so what's better? That's the way to do it. That's great way golf to live with the family. Right? That's it. That's what mm -hmm. it's about. All right, That's terrific. Good catching up with you. Nice to see you guys. Yeah, yeah you too. And good. I'll see you in a couple of weeks. That's right. We'll Sorry. be there. Beautiful. <laughs> All right, so great day overall. Sorry we couldn't show you guys everything because today it's an actual. You know, it's Thursday. It's the first day of the event, so. You know, it gets a little bit dicey with broadcast. I can't get too close with certain things, but we were in there, great day, had a lot of fun. Uh, Mike, what was your favorite part? I love the atmosphere. It's definitely playoff atmosphere. You could tell it's the fall. I love fall golf, leading right up to the Ryder Cup. All the big names are here, well, most of them at least. Yeah. Um, so, course looks awesome. It's in great shape, like we experienced, what, three weeks ago? Yeah. So, but uh, good to be back and it's been a fun week here. It's a great way to kick off the FedEx Cup playoffs and I always enjoy it here at Ridgewood, obviously being in our backyard, but also just like it's a great track. We got to play it, we had a lot of fun. So 
you like this video, make sure you guys like and subscribe and post your comments below because we want to hear some, you know, want to hear from you guys what you think of it all. If you were here, let us know about your experience for sure. All right, see you soon.